morning it is monday morning of week 13 dear god i need to clean my mascara properly it's monday morning just finished a treadmill hit session i'm actually dripping it's that oh i'm so amazing you can just do like 20 seconds of sprinting and 20 or 30 seconds of rest um i used to do 20 and 40 but it just takes so long you want to get it over with faster so just 20 and then 20 and 20 if you can manage it and at 30 if you need a little bit longer. But yeah, all good. So I'm gonna do legs and bum now. So that's my favorite. work colleagues do this to me. It's so unfair. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Quick and handy dinner, just slice the chicken breast and put in your frozen veg, bit of chicken stock, some curry paste and some tomatoes and you are done. Okay, so chicken curry with corn on the cob and broccoli. <laughs> Good morning, it is Tuesday of week 13. I'm just in from the gym and my arms and shoulders are dead but I'm actually really starting to notice that like they're slimming down and getting smaller and getting tighter, everywhere's getting leaner. Really starting to notice noticing some massive changes this weekend. It's Tuesday of week 13! Oh my face is, looks better! Yay! This is I am having a wee bit of comfort food tonight. I am having baby boy potatoes sautéed with onions in soy sauce with a can of tuna, some baked beans and some cheese. There definitely are leaner dishes out there but it's not that bad. There's loads of protein, there's carbs, it's all clean, it's fine. And um, yeah, I bust my balls in the gym this morning and work was brilliant so I'm going to go upstairs after I eat this. I say I'm gonna do a blog work but I'm probably gonna watch How I Met Your Mother for like two episodes and then do some blog work. Wish I had like a tablet or something I could watch How I Met Your Mother on and then do blog work on my laptop that would be so blissful. But I will soon when I move into my new house. It's 23 days, not that anyone's counting. The state of that kitchen. Those dishes have been there since Sunday. Last week. Just finished ass day with Amy and Amy and oh my god, like look at my face. Have you ever seen this much fat? I'm disgusting, I'm like a human bubble. Oh my god. Just got a message from my ex-colleague in my last job. And I am in the paper today. I'm back home in Fermanagh. I'm in the Fermanagh Herald today for videos in my blog. And oh my god, I'm so excited. <laughs> um, thank you so much to Emma Ryan for thinking of putting me in there and showing me the questions and stuff. And thank you so much to Erin Sharkey from EM EM Imagery for just taking the best pictures ever because they kept my website up a gear so much. Thank you. I've had such a nice day today. It is, what day is it? Wednesday evening and I'm just gonna make some dinner. I'm gonna have an omelette, I think, with chorizo and mushrooms and cheese and spinach. And then honestly, I think I'm just gonna go to bed and get some sleep because I think I've been going to sleep at like half 12, one o'clock every night and then get up at half five and I had felt fine but the last two days I've just been like, Bleh. so sleep, sleep time. Wednesday dinner, chorizo, onion and stir fry vegetable omelette with hot sauce. Morning everyone, it is Thursday morning of week 13. I went to bed at half seven last night and slept until like half one and then woke up I went back to sleep and slept till half seven, so I'm going to the gym this evening, so no morning sesh today, but I feel like a new one, but I'm like, yay, <laughs> look, sleep, it's amazing. Um, and I'm going to make a wee takeaway breakfast for work, and I'm sure you going to show you, uh, I'm going to show you what I'm going to make. This is my little breakfast pot. It's a fillet of cod with garlic and pepper from Little, and two poached eggs with a bit of hot sauce, and it's amazing, full of protein, good fats, and it's so delicious, it's ridiculous. Really Afternoon, it is Thursday evening and I am starving, so I'm gonna make a chicken and an egg and mushroom bake. Now this would normally be a pie, like with body push recipe, but I've decided I'm gonna slice some baby boys really thinly on top of it and mix it up a bit because I want to petite. So this is the pie mix, it's bubbling away. I will link the body coach's um pie mix down below. It's absolutely amazing. It has got double cream in it, but it is really lean. It's got chicken, lakes, um, chicken lakes, mushroom, chicken stock. I put in mustard. You can use rosemary, but I had tarragon in the house, so that's what I put in, and just let it reduce down, and then put it in a pie dish, and I'm going to slice these potatoes on top of it. Yummy. 
This is Thursday night dinner. It is chicken and bro chicken and leek and mushroom bake with broccoli. Yummy. Oh, it's Friday morning. I so don't want to get up. No. And it's Friday, week 13. I'm just walking to work. I'm working eight to half four today because I am going to Belfast to go out for belated birthday celebrations with some of the girlies. Going to Cosmo for dinner and I am so excited. <laughs> I haven't eaten like Indian Chinese roast dinner Italian bit of hair out of place. Come back. There we go. <laughs> I'm just gonna eat everything. I'm so excited. Um and it's payday pizza Friday. Yay! So it's Friday morning and I have the office to myself because I'm in at eight. It's my breakfast today. It is a pear, a banana, a little bit of peanut butter and some soy yogurt with coconut. It is delicious, low in carbs, low in sugar and really high in protein. It's a really nice day. I'm so excited to get up to Belfast with the girlies. I'm so excited, oh my God. What do I love? Friday pizza Friday. I'm just doing my usual. This is my pizza Friday, so I've got three slices and some popcorn chicken and a newly married co-worker. Out with these two fabulous babes. Cheers. Shrap summer and uh, we're the tips of bird for a wee free dinner. Gin and tonic, is it? Gin and tonic. Gin and tonic. Yes, it is. My birthday treat. I've been thinking about this for days. Ever. Loads of crispy dog pancakes, and yes, that is a hash brown with gravy. Is it? Oh, is it? <laughs> Put all the curry. <laughs> Got that as well. <laughs> all of the curry, salt, chili chips, and fish fry now. Okay, so normally I am, as Jane says, a spec sauce now. Like, I can handle anything spicy, but this is about like three bites, and I'm like, the whole way down, I am on fire. Look at my neck. It's actually coming out my neck. <laughs> so Look nice. at this. It's amazing. <laughs> so, we were just leaving Cosmo. Look how tight my dress has got. Oh my god, it's actually got tighter on my boobs. I'm not even joking. Oh, I'm so full, I could die. In fact, I might. And, um, I feel like I can't breathe properly. <laughs> how do you feel, girl? <laughs> Jane, Dana, and I have been home since about half twelve, and that's when you know you're just over the hill. That's when you're just like, will we go dancing? Over the hill? No, let's just. Get into our jammies and drink on the sofa. Good night. Finally getting to guilt trip. And look at these bad boys. <laughs> Having my maple and bacon donuts. It's gorgeous. So I'm just on my second maple and bacon donut. Look at you, look at you being so sociable. <laughs> also just bought myself a box of these. The ones in work are going to love me. Saturday, we girly Saturday, we're at St. George's Market. I love this place. I never get to come here though because I always sort of forget about it, which is ridiculous considering how amazing it is. Just take a look. Taryn and she makes the most amazing Disney and Harry Potter and just amazing things ever. I'm gonna come back here and spend fifty-five thousand pounds. I will be back and I will be here and I will be spending all of my money. Yeah. <laughs> just in Urban Outfitters, she's seen this cactus stand. And it's just currently this really nice. Look at her! Look at that little happy face. It is! But Whoa, it's bright in here. But there's, I want everything. Standard Urban Outfitter Syndrome. I have deliberately avoided it for about a year and a half. And oh my God, I want everything. So look at the size of this bedroom again. The size of my head, even though I tried to get something smaller. 